Yes guys, yes people, welcome back to Chelsea Fan TV. Welcome back to another match day vlog as well for you guys. As you guys can tell, it's still pitch black. It's about 6.15 right now. We're just on our way to the club coach to take us all the way up to Newcastle. It is a seven hour long coach ride. You lot remember from the last match day vlog how long this away trip can be. It's a long one. Let's just hope it's not as bad as the last time we went to Newcastle with the Isaac Hayden 94th minute winner because that was just horrendous. And let's hope the St. James's Park curse doesn't turn its ugly head around again. But we are still top of the league. We are still in an amazing run of form, just coming off an amazing 7-0 win at Norwich. And this game really should be straightforward. Newcastle haven't won a game yet this season. They've been in terrible form despite the new owners and the good mood around St. James's Park. It's not going to change the lack of quality on the pitch and the poor tactics as well. So this game should be straightforward, but we know we struggle playing at this ground. We know the St. James's Park curse is heavy, so we need to continue to start breaking it the same way we did last season. We're going to head down to the ground. I'm going to try and get some sleep on the coach and just try and enjoy the away day. I haven't done an away day since the Spurs game. And we know what the record's like with these vlogs. Every time we do a match day vlog, we go and we get a W. So let's continue the streak as we mean to go on. We'll see you guys in the ground and let's hope we get the three points. Up the trails. We aren't making anything in the final five so far. Oh, Jorginho! That's a horrendous miss. 
scored a banger that was offside and now he's missed the center. That is mad. Oh, it's not been our luck so far. Not been our luck. Half time, still nil nil. We've had the majority of possession, but we just completely lacked creativity. Havertz is being surrounded in the middle, just like in the Norwich game. He's struggling to create anything. Ziyech's been misplacing passes all throughout the first half. It's been Hudson Odoi that's been our best attacker in the front three, to be honest. But we're just struggling in the attacking third. There's no creativity, there's no incisive passes. It's just heightened through balls that's just easy for Newcastle to pick out. Like defensively it's been easy for them, it's just they've been poor in the transition so this game's just been a bit of a stalemate. I'm not really too sure what's going to break the deadlock between the two of them. It would have been a great finish from Ziyech but he was offside and then he had a horrendous miss 10 minutes after that. I don't know, it's just not really been our day today. Have to see what happens in the second half but it has been a frustrating first half. Let's hope there's a goal because I did not travel seven hours to see Carl Darlow just time waste for 45 minutes. This is horrendous, but let's see what happens in the second half. Up the shells. On your own, on your own! 